Neverland, pr the promised Neverland, continues with a chapter four. And oh my god, was this an interesting chapter. Continues off where chapter three left off. Uh, further ado, hit the intro. Double up. Wah, wah. <laughs> Promised Neverland, Chapter Four, continues off ex where episode Chapter Three left off, with Norman and Emma going into the into the storage room to find they didn't find rope because they, there was no need for it in everyday lives. People don't normally need rope for any kind of thing. That it's it's one of those rare occasional essentials you need when you go camping and stuff like that. So they find tablecloths and, and they decide to use the tablecloths as their ropes to climb over the wall to get, escape the orphanage farm. So they climb up the tree and then they, Emma mentioned that isn't it about time we tell Ray about, about this. Without knowing, Ray was sitting there idly by wondering what, what was going on. Ray being the smart one as he is knew instantly that something was up, something was going down and everything when they came back when they said nothing was up, nothing was wrong and everything then just keeping shut of what they saw. After they told him what they saw about those demons that they saw and everything, Ray wasn't shocked or anything about, like that but he was intrigued about what's happening. So he discussed that it's impossible to get everybody out of there because we'd die before before we can get everybody to safety we'd, and everything and, and stuff. But Emma really wanted to get everybody and being irrational with Roy, it really continues to show that as well. That she just wants to save her family. She doesn't want them to be, to be harvested for these demon-like creatures and everything. So Ray and and Norman go off to one side, telling and Ray tell them to talk some sense into Emma. But Norman then just went, "I love her. I will do anything to do it." So you would allow her to say, "No, I'll make sure that I'm the one that dies and everything for her and and stuff like that, so that he's the one protect her and everything." And and Emma and we found out that Emma rarely cries. So when he found out that she cried at first, she he thought if she was scared, she was crying because she was scared. No, she was crying because she doesn't want to see her family be devoured like like we saw when we, when she saw Connie. If I said that was completely wrong and everything. So they come, they regroup and and everything. And he somewhat says that the maximum is the three of us secretly to Ray during their one on one talk, but. But then he mentions, throws in a book about mecha mechanics, and where it was, th it was the re the most recent book in the house was from 2015. So this is set 30. This series is set 30 years, years. So we're in 2016 now. So 29 years from now would make it 20 no 2045. So the Promise Neverland is set in the year 2045. Because the book is was lot was from 30 years ago, so so we, they discuss of what happened during those 30 years. What could have caused this? What could have caused the demons to come during this 30 years life um, span? And there could still be a human civilization still there somewhere, but they don't know. But that, like like they mentioned, th this book, this book, this mechanical engineering book is the last book, the most recent book they have in their possession that says 2015. So they said that we have to collect intel about the outside world. We have to collect information as much as possible, even if it's just from Mama herself and stuff like that. Because there's so much information they need to get before they can activate the plan of escaping the offices and try and survive outside. But other than that, this series continues to amaze me, continues to interest me a lot. And I am going to be continuing it with you guys as well. This has become my series that I've been waiting to review for you guys and waiting to read and review. This is the first series that I've read from chapter one and I am loving every chapter of it. So comment down below if you've been following The Promised Neverland and have checked out chapter four. Comment down below what you loved and didn't love about this chapter. The mystery is still growing and I'm loving every minute of it. I'm curious about what's going to happen. We get to see in this chapter well a quick, a quick glimpse of the stopwatch 
on the pocket watch that Mama has. That's actually the transmit of the three dots of them being surrounded. And hope and she might and maybe in next chapter it might narrow down to her three lives and that's Emma, Norman, and Ray speaking and learning the truth about the farm orphanage and everything like that but we don't really know at this point of what's going to happen in chapter five i'm just so happy this series is continuing where it is is so comment down below what you liked and didn't like about this chapter chapter and leave your feedback as well i'll be continuing this series next week as well so check stay tuned for chapter five of the promised neverland see you next time bye bye for now i've been your host kai from kaizo technical corner member of the double o club and i'll see you next time see ya hey guys kai from kaizo Taker corner here and i hoping you enjoyed this week's review of the promised neverland chapter four i'm going to be continue reviewing this guys along with fairy tale on mondays and and everything so stay tuned to that i hope you enjoyed you can check press the i and check out the last three chapters of the promised neverland along with the playlist by pressing the i at any point of this video if i remember to include the cards that's a big if comment down below what you'll enjoyed and if you like this video and you want to keep up to date with the reviews of the promised neverland you can hit that subscribe button and keep up to date with all the promised neverland review chapters that i am going to be announced be reviewing for you guys if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and enjoy what you watched. If you've got Facebook, it link is down in the video description. You can follow my Facebook fan page as well. The links are down in the video description, along with my Twitter. And if you've got that Anime Amino app, you can search Kai's Otega Corner on there and follow me there. I don't go on a match, but you can follow me there. Other than that, I've been your host, Kai from Kai's Otega Corner, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye for now. See ya!